afternoon, class. I'm Dr. James. I'm your instructor for today. And today we are going to be working with a character map. And as you see, it, the way you fill it out is the title, the character that you will select, the author, the illustrator, and then there are other things that are maybe going on with the, your character. Uh, right? What he may or how they say. Uh, what they think. Uh, what they feel. And how they act. And you may find some other things. And you know this is sort of like a sick man. But they have these other graphic uh, areas for you to fill in and things that you may uh, read. And we're dealing with two characters. One is a banker and one is a lawyer. And they are the characters in this story. And our story is called The Bet. The B-E-T. Like you bet for money, okay. It, they're betting for money too, but it's uh, what they will be doing. Okay, this is a micro lesson. This is part of a larger lesson plan, and this is the guided practice portion. And as I stated before, that we're going to be working with a character map and of the banker and of the lawyer. Of course, we're dealing with certain uh, environmental issues like isolation. And uh, um, there's an argument among people. Is the death penalty ever moral? Uh, and also, is a person who's in isolation a uh, human? And Dr. Uh, Reverend Tutu says that when a person is in isolation, in essence, they cease to be human uh, because they don't have any relationship with people, especially when they're in a uh, Solitary confinement. As I previously stated, this is a, is a guided practice activity. It, it's for 15 minutes, it may be 20 minutes. Our students, profile of our, of our students, or their ages are between 17 and 24. Uh, the language proficiency is between 8th and 12th grade level. Uh, the students are in a job training and career development program. And uh, we're diff using different types of technology for this uh, guided practice. And we began with uh, instructional media technology, which is a short video of the bet. And it was shown doing more up and we're using it now. And the video will show how uh, the, not the lawyer and the banker and certain other people, certain experiences they have. But also you will recognize um, what an individual could go through while in isolation. And you as a student can assess some of the characteristics of the characters from the video. Yes, yes I agree. Kill the guy, Kill the guy story's, over. story's over. If you lock him away for life, life, that's actually that's actually 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 Look, 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 you guys are contradicting your own point. I mean, what could I mean, be more true than actually ending his whole story? 
You don't know you anything. Don't know anything. And can you and imagine can you yourself imagine locked away for a whole life in one room? Depends on what Depends I'm getting, on what getting, getting done. done. Really? Really? I'll give you 10, give you million, 10 million if you just lock, you just lock yourself just, lock just, five, yourself years. just five years. You know what? You know what? Make it, make 50, make it million 50 million for 10 years. For 10 years. Oh, oh, have you guys gone you crazy? Shut up, guys. Shut up, guys. I'm serious. I'm serious. This guy is serious. Guy is serious. I think this will be, think this will be interesting. Shall we decide Shall the terms? Shall we decide the terms? Okay. 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 This is an excerpt from a video based on the decks. It will help you to think about uh, filling out your character map of the uh, banker and the lawyer and then other people. The bet is a, a fictional story, short story by Anton Chekhov. Okay, and as I previously stated, that you're going to develop this character map. And it is an organization and brainstorming tool or technology. The character map will show you some of the main components of the banker or the lawyer, whichever one you decide, the characteristics. For example, what the banker or the lawyer might say and what they might think, uh, what they might look like, and how the characters act, and how do others view and treat them. Okay, students, you can reread the story either at the online digital library, uh, come lit odd or you have a PDF copy of the story available in your email. I send it to each student and we are the email is a communication tool tool. Students you will gather in a group after about 10 minutes to discuss how the characters impact themselves, one another, how they're impacted by their setting, how they're impacted by the plot. And by you gathering and discussing and sharing with uh, other students what you have learned from developing the character map, we call this uh, practice and collaboration. If you have any questions, just raise your hand. I will be walking around and, and seeing how you are doing. The objective for this activity is that your comprehension of the reading is supported by the framework or by the character map. Uh, 
and you can identify and organize details about your character or characters. You as a writer will see how key ideas and details fit and flow overall or together. Just for your information, a character map is a graphic organizer because you can see what you're doing, you're seeing what the character's features are, and they help you to learn about the character in the story and how the character, again, is impacted and is impacted by the setting and other characters, as we already see at the plot. The character map will be used during and after you read the text or the story. As you read, you will complete the character map. This is more efficient and you're learning and, and you don't have to go back and repeat. After reading, you kind of go over, uh, look everything. And then if you're missing any parts, then you will fill it in. Any questions? Thank you. All right, to help you, to help you, to help you. Uh, there are questions, guiding questions. We will put it up on the board, up on the whiteboard, so that you can see what it is. But interesting is, what is the bet between the lawyer and the banker? Uh, the lawyer will pay the banker what? If he can't do what, the lawyer must spend anywhere between how many years, and the banker and the lawyer who will attempt to see who can last. Can can the lawyer stay in solitary confinement for the designated time, and also the banker? And pay attention to the ending of this story. Oh, it's amazing. What does occur? And, and that's another way you can look and see what affects both of those characters. And again, this is the character map. And we're asking you to fill it out. Uh, take all your, put out your information. Let it come from the reading. And it'll be interesting and a little fun to discuss it with your classmates. Thank you for listening. Dr. James.